Hey there, I just want to do a quick check in and let you know that I have moved to LA for a month. Uh, in Portland, it is incredibly rainy at this time of the year, so my wife and I just kind of hopped up, moved to LA. She's able to work down here too, and our dog is loving it. Uh, I just wanted to give you the quick tour of the house. Here it is. We rented a great Airbnb in Abbott Kinney, uh, and I'm just going to walk inside here. And the, the important thing to let you know is that I need a studio. And so I'm going to be looking around this house here. You can see it's very brightly colored walls, really kind of a cool uh, artistic flair. Actually, this is one of my favorite rooms here, this outdoor dining room. Um, but I'm going to need a studio. So what the beauty is you're going to get to see me build a studio from scratch. So here we go. Just kind of quick giving you the tour. Here is the master bedroom. Um, very nice, nice red walls. Um, really cool bathroom, very artistic once again. So that's cool little toilet design and very fishy. Also, you can hear the echoey in here because it is so, um, so hard on the, the walls. But I think where my studio is going to go is back in this back bedroom. So you can see here, I'm gonna give you a little, little look around. We've got a white wall on one side with some artwork that I can probably take down. Uh, there's a couple of windows, but the windows don't have a lot of sunlight coming through them. Uh, there's this great outdoor patio, but it's covered uh, out this window. And this window, uh, just the direction that it's facing, um, is north, so we're not gonna see a lot of sunlight coming through there. So a couple other things about this room. Um, we've got the white walls. We've also got these blue walls, um, which are kind of textured, which is you know gonna be funny. And we've got this, this kind of flower sticking up, so maybe we'll do something with that. Um, the closet actually just has a curtain over it, which is actually a nice thing because the closet doors would be, would create a little more echo, but this fabric is going to make the room a little uh, less echoey. Um, on the windows, I've got some hooks up here, so I'll be able to um, drape some more fabric around the room just to make it a little less echoey. There's a little echo in here, but you can see there's there's wood floors and not a lot of carpet, just a little area rug there. So that's that's contributing to the echo. So the more fabric I can bring to this room, the better. Um, so, and the other thing is, I mean, there's a bed in the middle of the room. Um, and one thing is you never want to have a bed in your shots, unless unless that's kind of your niche. Um, because it, everyone's always gonna go there. They're gonna think, oh wow, there's a bed in this shot. So we're gonna have to make sure that we don't see the bed in the shots, move it around. It's good though in terms of it's going to be absorbing some of that, that vibrating sound. Um, another thing in this room is that mirror you see in the background right there. I love having a full length mirror in the room that I'm shooting. So I can just, right before I start shooting, just look in the mirror, kind of fix my hair a little bit, make sure I look good, and then go. So I love the fact that that's in this room. The other thing to notice, the ceiling is kind of a bluish. It's got these clouds on it. So we wouldn't be able to bounce a lot of light off of there. That's something I do in my home studio is I have a white ceiling and I bounce the light, the fill light off the ceiling. So not something that we're gonna be able to do here. Another thing in this room is, that we've got a light here, which is great to have, except those bulbs are, uh, those are kind of warm white bulbs. So it's not gonna match the, the bulbs in my daylight balance. It doesn't match what's coming in the windows. So won't be able to use those, but I do always bring with me some extra bulbs so that I can have that cool white bulb that I'm looking for. The last problem that there is, and I'm not sure how I'm gonna solve this one, is right out this window. That's the neighbor's house, and they've got a barky dog. So that one, I'm still working on figuring that out because right now, dog's not barking. Um, and in LA, this is kind of an interesting thing. I didn't know this about LA, but you can't really talk to your neighbors. Um, everyone's yards are 100% fenced off, at least here in Abbott Kinney, and they're you know six foot, plus the tall fences and you can't actually knock on someone's front door because their front door is inside their fence. So um, otherwise I might be chatting with them to kind of work out a time to say, okay, yeah, well, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm filming videos here and I just need like an hour a day on, let's just agree on a time or something like that. But uh, for now, 
uh, really happy with, uh, with our place here in Abbot Kinney, and I'll be back with you guys very soon showing you how this studio is starting to shape up. Thanks.